Yep. Yep. Good. Good fish. In this episode of Sea Track Battle on Foon. Fish. I think that Team Klaus is uh, fighting very hard today. You know where the fish were. Yep. Who's going to win day three? You're first today. We're first today. Yes, please. They're both well known from the series Sea Trout Secrets, and they're the best of friends. But once again, it's time for the Sea Trout Battle on Foon. The programs are presented by Sims, Abu Garcia and Grays, Go Fishing, and Sea Trout Foon. Two teams compete against each other with four fishing days to decide the winners. It all takes place on the Danish island of Foon, and three cameramen do their best to follow the competitors closely for the whole competition. Team Thomas are Lars Kainau and Thomas Hansen. Team Klaus are Peter Alexanderson from Sweden and Klaus Eriksson. Welcome to the lodge. Uh, we are really happy to have you also this year. And just a short update. The fishing around Hellness was really good this year. We had a lot of guests in the last weeks and uh, even if tough weather, the fishing was good. So I'm pretty sure you will have a, a good time. The teams have now moved to Denmark Fishing Lodge on Hell Ness. The lodge is situated on Hell Ness, close to all the good spots that fish well in the northeasterly wind that's blown up over the last couple of days. On Funen, it's always possible to find good fishing places, no matter where the wind comes from. Let's see the weather for tomorrow here. Here, here Peter, that's this Essence, that's uh, the closest town here. Yeah. And a uh, lot of sunshine and northeast wind. That's actually a good wind down here. Uh, that's fine, but but there's a lot of wind. I you can see, see that. Just, but but not in the morning. But it will pick up mm. in the middle of the day. Mm. Let's see the water level because that's very important for sea trout fishing. Uh, again, for essence and down here. That's today. You can see for tomorrow. It's uh, okay. Uh, normally, you will see the line goes goes high water and low water will go un under the red line. <laughs> But tomorrow it just it when it's low it's, it's when it's low it's it's very high. <laughs> <laughs> it stays on very high. Yeah, very high all day long. Yeah. But but that's not too bad. That's bad on some places, but it's actually very good on other places. Uh, I have a few that's ideas cool. in mind. Yeah, yeah. But but it's it's okay. It will work. It'll work definitely. Let's just for fun have a look on. Uh, are there any fish caught at the moment here in Funen? And uh, the best way to look at that is uh, the Go Fishing web page here. And they have uh, people write in catch reports. And those here are for today, three hours ago, four hours ago. And Beautiful fish. Yeah, there are some, some nice fishes caught, I can see. This one was from yesterday, I see. So that's perfect. Yeah. Well, we need some points. So we will go for, for the big, biggest fish of the competition today. Um, I have some reef where, where sometimes there's a big fish. Klaus and Peter drive to Toru. Here, early in the morning, there's hardly any wind. Today, Peter, we really need a good start. Yep. The other days, when the, when the phone has ringed, we have caught nothing. <laughs> Today, we need to at least have caught a fish before they phone us and tell, tell us they got eight. So, should we yeah. go from, from each side or...? Yeah, I think so. Yeah. There was a fish in the surface out here. You saw a rising fish? I saw something, but it, yeah, looks, okay. it looked small. I don't know yeah, what yeah, it yeah. was. Yep. Yep. Good. Good fish. 
आओ इट्स दैट वाज द फिश बिफोर लंच वी टॉक्ड अबाउट बट इट्स अंडर फॉर या इट इज Peter, we got a fish in the morning. <laughs> First time we got a fish before lunch. Klaus, we are on track. We are the winning team today. <laughs> it's it's always nice to feel a fish in the, immediately because for your own confidence, <laughs> better fish that should be really nice. Oh yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. nice Klaus. Ah, good, good, good. One. <laughs> small one, but still a fish. This one is so small that it's in the category don't count. But uh, Peter, just fish this way uh, to to the place where we came down. Yeah. And I will move a little further down there. Yeah. And see if I can find something there. Yeah. Let's see. Let's see. It had been nice if we had seen a fish in the surface, but nothing is happening. But no, oh, there's another fish after the bite. Take it. There you go. Yeah. <laughs> There was a whole school of fish out here. But little ones, little ones. Sometimes it's only small ones, but often there's one or two bigger fish between all the small ones. Ah, there was a new one. <laughs> ah. Another baby. But okay, the fish here. That's important. Get in here, little guy. Next year. Thomas and Lars can't stay away from Gambor Fjord, where they had such success last time they were there. Fish. It was very close to shore that one. <laughs> We went up uh, early this morning, and we started up a place we fished actually before from the other side uh, in Gambarfjord, and uh, we have had a few fish this morning right away. So we hope it gets better uh, within the next uh, few hours when the sun comes up. I think that Team Klaus is uh, fighting very hard today, uh, and they really want to uh, get back in the game. So. Uh, but so are we, and we want to beat him. I think it looks quite clear though. Yeah, it's, it's okay. Yeah. Well, we just go a little around the corner and we just can fish uh, 10 minutes here maximum. Nice fish. It's in the wheat, it's in the wheat. 
No, 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 no. Keep out. Woo. We have to get out of this suite here. Okay. Now we're in more open water. Not yet. Yeah. Nice fish. Definitely owner 45. 52. 52. That's perfect. That was good. That was really, really good. At least we have a fish over 45 before lunch. Any fish, Peter? Yeah, I caught one. You caught no. one? Yeah, a small one, but small I, have, one. A, okay. That's I nice. have a big one after. You it went one? two times. I, I have it the, so I have the same just close up, to up. me. I, uh huh. You after had the same. I caught that one. It was also the same size. Ah. After it's like, whoo. oh yeah, very close. Yeah. 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 Okay. I just my heart stopped. <laughs> <laughs> you go back, and I just take the yeah. last uh, then, yeah, the okay. last 50 meters here. You know where the fish were. Yeah. Yeah, it was on this weed here. Ah, that was it. Snagging on it. Oh, is it? Is I have a follower. <laughs> Not a big fish, but still a fish. How, how big was the fish? Fifty-two. Oh, good. So that was good, good yeah, for yeah, us. Yeah. Very good stuff. That gives us a little hope. <laughs> Come on. Yeah, yeah that one. <laughs> there was one just next to the shore here again. A smaller fish. They are very close to shore here. So, come on. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I lost it. <laughs> the fish uh, can stay very close to the shore here. So it's important to uh, cast the lure in here before I'm waiting down there. Ja, ah, han er fisk. Okay. In the morning I fished behind Thomas and tried a few different spots um, just around the corner. Uh, but I haven't seen any big fish today. Team Klaus are still on the Toru Peninsula. Yo, fish, fish! Oh, nice! There's another one. Yeah. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Still a little one. Actually, we, we came up to a, a reef where the nicest current was running. It was so great, that current. So I was sure there would be fish out there. I was sure there would be some, some nice sized fish. But actually, there was only two small fish on that reef. That was a little strange. Sometimes sea trout don't know what good condition are. <laughs>
It looks perfect here. You can actually see all the sand and then you can see the dark reef coming in. Yep. And the fish, the current come this way. The fish will stand on the current side, that side where the current hit the reef. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So we have to move up to the bird, wait out and fish this down, way down here. Down yeah. this way, yeah, yeah. okay. It looked good, but uh, no fish. Let's see what the other guys are doing. Let's see if we can reach Thomas here. Hello, Klaus. Hey, Thomas. So how are you doing today and what have you caught? We're doing a little, little better today. Uh, eight under and one over. Okay. And you? Uh, we have uh, 12 under and no, okay. uh, nothing on, over. How many over? Nothing. Nothing over. Oh, oh, we're that, still in the game. <laughs> that gives us a little hope. <laughs> okay, okay. But uh, we have some hours left, so we will get one more big fish. Where are you? Where are you? We are in Torø, we, but we are leaving now. We are finished here. We have hooked them up. <laughs> yeah, yeah. No more fish here. Okay. See you later. Bye. Good luck. We still have hope. But they will have the same problems that we have with all those weeds that going out in the oh, high lakes. water. Uh, yeah. Little more we are not finished. Nice. We will. We will get more. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah we will yeah, get yeah, more yeah. definitely. Let's go. Get them. Let's go. Let's go. Let's take some more small ones. When we fish like this, you can see Thomas is following the shoreline uh, and fishing along along that area. And I cast in a different direction to cover as much water as possible. Okay, Lars. We tried two spots now. Yeah. And only fish under 45. Mm -hmm. We have to catch a big one, and we only have three and a half hour left. Yeah. So uh, let's try go closer to Hellness and try maybe one or two spots on the way back. Uh, and then we started moving towards the next three stops that we had planned. All three of them were rubbish because of, there was too much weed in the water. Uh, we have uh, extreme high water at the moment, so uh, it's very difficult with the lures when there's so much weed. That was a nice trip and Torø. Yeah, we fished, uh, yeah, you can see we fished all the way around. The biggest fish were here on this stretch yeah, here. Yeah, yeah. But the wind ball. just picked up, so, so now we cannot go there now. But now we just make a short drive and go up here and try this one. The wind should be perfect for this stretch here up here. Not the most popular, I don't know. It looks good, the water here. But you see on tour where we were before, that's pretty windy now on, on, this, on the good side there. Yeah, that was that was not the best part. I actually hoped for a lot of more here, but uh, okay. We are now going back in the direction of the lodge and fish the bay area at the lodge. Yep. Small one. <laughs> the last 15 minutes, uh, Peter really ran in a, a, a school of smaller fish. Are they double? Klaus called and said, you had to run to the car. <laughs> and I was just into a, a big school of sea trout. On the place he told me that was the best place on that stretch. That was wonderful. Teamwork, I call it. Yep. Whoa. Nice fish. Okay, who's first today? You're first today. We're first today. Yes, please. <laughs> we have uh, 15 under and one over. Okay. And biggest 52. <laughs> and you? We have 13 under. 13? Under. 
And mm. nothing over. Oh! Boom! <laughs> you got it! Yeah! 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 One fish! Yes! <laughs> one fish! Oh my god. Oh. That was oh. my friend. Oh. 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 We still have a chance. Yeah, now we're still really <laughs> under pressure. <laughs> oh. Oh. That was close. Yes. That was close. Yes. That was really close. So <laughs> now maybe it'll be exciting tomorrow. <laughs> Now this could be exciting. Team Klaus win the day in style, winning all six points. Yeah, yeah we still have a chance. Yeah. Tomorrow will be very will be settled. Very settled. Yeah. Let's show up our books. <laughs> <laughs> and we were very excited today because we had a lot of points before this day and uh, also we had a lot of confidence on our spots. So uh, Tomorrow we are really under pressure. Whew, what a great and windy day! But uh, at least, at, la I think at least, but at last we won a whole day. We got all points today, and that was so important. That was so important. So uh, we will really work hard tomorrow. It's very strong conditions, uh, difficult, difficult, strong northeastern wind, and extremely high water. But still, we managed, both teams actually managed to get a lot of fish, mostly smaller fish, but every day we hook fish over 50 centimeters. So that says a little bit about the possibilities around here. That was a really great day. Tomorrow we'll get even higher water, so, so that will be... <laughs> I must think a lot about the plan tomorrow. I don't have it for sure yet, but I'll, I'll, I'll find out something. But we have to really count that high water in. Tomorrow is going to be exciting. Uh, the other guys are closing in on us, so we really need to make a, a good effort tomorrow and, um, and make the final punch. The next episode is the big decider. Both teams are under pressure and they're pushing themselves to the limit. Yeah, that was the, was a bigger one. Yeah. Ah. Yeah. Okay. There'll be fish there. Okay. Yeah. Oi. Oh. oh, that's a good one. Definitely all of 45. We can go in and just. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. That's a bigger fish. Way bigger fish. <laughs> we have a chance. <laughs> the tension's really building now, and it's the last fish that will make the winning difference. Big fish. Oh, it's a nice fish. That fish could win for us. Very big fish. Come on. Oh. This is it. Yeah! <sighs> Who's going to win the day? And who wins the whole competition? The programme's presented by Sims, Abu Garcia and Grays, Go Fishing and Sea Trout Foon. Now, watch this drive.